eighth, fifth, or sixth, depending on your definition. Brian International's a member for SKT. Mid-season invitational champions, as you can see here, world superstar, football superstar, two-time World Cup champion Ronaldo making his way onto the stage, along with another very famous face, BRTT, in the League of Legends community, to present SK Telecom with their winner's medals. One legendary two-time World Cup champion here to award to a couple two-time world champions of the club. And let's remember, SK Telecom has just completed the most dominant two-year run in the history of League of Legends as an eSport. And something that I don't think will ever be equal. We're still very young in League of Legends as a sport, as an eSport. However long the game goes, this sort of dominance that looked impossible at the start of the scene. We're a part of history, just watching on as SKT continue to make. I love what I saw when they went for the MSI trophy as well. Booty getting to lift first, making sure Peanut could get to lift that trophy as well, bringing the whole team into this experience. Yeah, we have to remember, as was said at the beginning of the day, Papa Smithy, that this organization is a dynasty with members that have, you know, come and left and come and left, and yet the dominance has always been there for those two members. Their first international win in a Riot tournament, Booty and Peanut should be proud. They were chasing something, you know, honestly, every player is when they move along. But when you move to SKT, it's the big goal that you're chasing. And for Hooney, it's a culmination, as Freak put, of a very long and winding path to get to SK Telecom. And for Peanut, he was the one who was supposed to take down SKT. He went the other route. He's feeling pretty damn good about his decision now. And we can't forget the guy behind it all, right? Coma there on your screen gets his medal as well. I mean, this man is a, is a great mind within League of Legends esports. And, and that's really what it takes, because not only within League of Legends, but really across all sports, it's rare to see this kind of dominance. This level of domination internationally for this many years. And Baker, the man himself, the greatest player of all time. Receiving the medal from one of the greatest footballers of all time. A, tra a transformative footballer in his own right. Ronaldo was a superstar and then so. Speaking of superstars. Very true. I mean, you've got Faker on your team. The fact that you can make a name for yourself. The likes that Peanut has. I mean, it's incredible. Wolf as well, outspoken in his own individual abilities. Shows up time and time again. Has matured fantastically as a player here. Can we step back for a moment? You know, seven Prime years Zuma into the eSport, we have Team Ronaldo passing a gold medal to Faker. for them and yet they fought through and achieved victory and even though skt often makes it look easy it's never easy everyone wants this just as much as skt does but time and time again skt showed they are the best and this just i mean, raises the question how far does this team and this organization go i mean papa smith you said perhaps a run that will never be matched again but let's let's remember that this run's not over right this, they've just hit one milestone, and now it's about can they push forward. They'll be defending champions if they are to make it to the 2017 World Championships later this year. It's the sort of run that should never happen, Dash. The game changes every meta. The meta has evolved, and SK Telecom have rolled with the meta, and that's why the domination is unprecedented. And to me, to answer that question, you have to ask another. When does Vaker and Coma retire?
That sound like Nana? That sounds pretty close. Woo! We're running! Hey, can I execute? No! What do you mean? Oh my, Kipo. Wait, they- Oh yeah, no, they were loaded slime game. Oh wait, that's- that's a Jace! Jace! You're trolling! That had been Mr. Vincent, you're just sacrificing your teammates so you can live? That's fucked up, man. Look, all your teammates are just dying because you held your ulti to save yourself. I'm in spares or not? I'm not even the one killing you. Somebody else is killing him. Are you fucking serious, dude? Are you fucking serious, bro? Dude, we will do this all fucking day, dude. And he wants to report me. Jesus Christ. Mine, you dumb cunt. Okay, sorry. Oh my god! <gasps> what the fuck? Why did it go flying? No! Alright, it didn't work. What the hell just happened? We'll get you, man. I see who's killed till you want to go. Hang it up. Ah, that. 나 당대님 방송 알아. 나 전에 한번 봤어. 